Our next man of strength and style is Randy Halstead. Randy's best qualities, according to Randy, are his red hair, blue eyes, and the fact that he was raised in South Dakota. Randy has a bachelor's degree from Oklahoma City Christian College and a master's from ACU. He spent 11 years in congregational ministry and eight years as a financial administrator for nonprofit agencies. For the past three years, he's been the executive director of Abilene Hope Haven. Randy wants us to remember him as a man who cares about folks who live in poverty, and he wants to continue to make a difference in the lives of people who struggle. All right, he's going off, off the reservation here. Randy considers his greatest accomplishments to be marrying a wonderful person, Jackie, and raising two fantastic daughters, Aaron, age 21, and Ashley, age 18. All right, there's tips in the audience. The family includes two black labs, Casey and Zeus. Randy lists his hobbies as cycling, soccer referee, fantasy football, and short mission trips. And we know that he'll be donating all that cash. <laughs> Every August, he loves riding in the Hiram Hell 100 mile bike ride in Wichita Falls, along with 10,000 other crazy people. A great pair of cords from American Living, like those Randy's wearing, has a spot in every well-dressed guy's wardrobe. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, cords are back. His shirt is from the Stafford Essentials Cotton Blend Broadcloth line. These shirts are wardrobe staples featuring their commitment to wear, wearability and quality. The shirt features fitted tailoring, wrinkle-free performance, and an extra-long shirt tail that stays tucked. His look is topped off with a wool tweed Westcott vest from American Living. This vest has a classic style that looks great with everything from jeans to dress pants. Randy hopes someday to see Tour de France in person, to live in Portland, Oregon, and to coach his grandkids' soccer teams. About his favorite saying, Randy told us, I could tell you, but then I'd have to shoot you. We don't know if that is his favorite saying, or if he really just can't tell us. Thanks, Randy.